Welcome to the e-learning for Sage 50 on the topic of the user management. In Sage 50, the application can handle more than one user, which is a very common for administrator to handle and manage user for the application. We will teach you step by step on how to create, maintain and assign function rights to each of the user. Let's start, begin with create new user for Sage 50. Firstly, log in into the system. To create new user, go to the left panel menu of the application. Select Control Panel then choose Administrator Task option. New tab will open and labeled as Administrator Task. Indicate and choose Manage User icon to create a new user in the system. User listing screen will shown. This listing will list out all the users in the application whether they are system admin or their status is active or not. To create new user, click on the new icon on the top panel to enter profile's information, including picture of the user. After all the information needed already filled in, click Save icon to save the new user. Then, refresh on the user listing screen to confirm whether the new user is already included in the listing or not. Next, we will go to the user group and assign function. Each group will have different function. To maintain user group, go to the left panel menu of the application. Select control panel then choose administrator task option. Indicate and choose manage user group icon to view the user group listing in the system. User group listing screen will shown. This listing will list out all the user group sorted using group code in the application whether they are system admin or other group codes. To maintain user group, click one of the user group available in the listing. Each user group can be deleted and edited accordingly. To assign function rights on user group, Simply go to the Function Rights tab in the User Group Maintenance and edit all the group's function rights in the system according to the group's preferences. Then, click Save icon to save all the changes made. Next, to assign function rights on each user, go to the Function Rights tab in the User Maintenance and edit all the user's function rights in the system based on the company accordingly. Then, click Save icon to save all the changes made. Thank you, and have a nice day.